It's been a while since I've done an animal fight. So today, I have a simple yet close one for y'all. Spotted hyena versus leopard. Who wins? Well, let's find out. So, let's start off with size. Leopards can weigh up to over 200 pounds, but they typically don't. That's typically just ones in the zoos and whatnot. And in the wild, they typically weigh about 160, 170 pounds. Uh, They're three to four feet long and two to three feet tall. But a female hyena can weigh over 150 pounds. Uh, They're about two to three feet long and about three feet tall. So size is roughly even. There's a little differences here and there, but they're mostly even. At least between a male leopard and a female hyena. Uh, So let's look at their physicality. Leopards are powerful predators, despite their smaller size actually being the smallest out of the big cats. uh, They can lift, carry, and drag dead prey two to three times their own size up into trees with ease. I'm talking animals like warthogs and gazelles, zebras and wildebeest and uh, deer and whatnot. Uh, And like all cats, leopards are incredible athletes. Honestly, I think cats are like the best athletes in the world outside of primates (laughs) um they can run up to 40 miles per hour leap 20 feet in a single bound and can jump 10 feet straight up into the air they also have a bite force of about 300 to 310 psi as well Um, but a hyena's physical strength comes mostly from its bite as its bite force it is just outstanding for its size. They bite with a force of 1,100 PSI. Holy crap. <laughs> yeah, they can crush bone like it's celery or like, or like how we eat celery or carrots or something. Just shatter it to pieces with their bite. Um, these guys can also run 37 miles per hour and their stamina is insane. They can run at this speed for miles, days. <laughs> okay, maybe not days, but you, you get what I'm saying. They can just run and run and go and go. Um, so the leopard is the better athlete, being able to run faster, leap farther and higher, and it just has more agility. And I'd also say it's just overall stronger. However, the hyena has a significantly stronger bite and has a much better endurance. Uh, So, how do they hunt? Leopards are like all solitary cats. They use the ambush strategy, pouncing onto unsuspecting prey, holding onto them with their paws and claws and biting their neck until the prey dies of suffocation or blood loss. Simple. Hyenas have a bad rep for only being scavengers, and and that's just not the case. Uh, while they do scavenge or bully other predators from their kill, um, they also just chase down their prey into exhaustion, as they can just outlast almost anything in a dead sprint. And remember, 37 miles per hour. <laughs> that's like 10 miles per hour faster than Usain Bolt, the fastest man as ever exists as far as on record um so yeah they just chase them down and as they're chasing them they take bites out of them to let blood start coming out and then they start when they fall over the prey the hyenas literally start eating it alive (laughs) that's how you know you're an effective hunter that's how you be an effective hunter Uh, you start eating it while it's alive you don't wait for it to die Both of these hunting strategies have worked for millions of years, which is why they still do it to this day. (laughs) Uh, The leopard has razor sharp claws and with its more usable limbs and athletic body, it will have a reach and grappling advantage over a hyena. But hyenas are smarter. Their intelligence is on par with primates and are able to coordinate attacks to take down large prey, as well as typically steal food from lions and other predators. Uh, So, who wins? Well, despite these two predators living next to each other in the same environment, I doubt this encounter happens very much, if at all, for a few reasons. Firstly, 
there's too much of a risk to try to hunt, fight, and kill one another, as both could be severely injured, injured or even die in the fight. And secondly, hyenas are rarely alone, as they live in clans with up to 80 to 100 members. It'd be suicide if the le leopard tried that. Uh, even the most hungry and desperate leopard wouldn't try that. Uh, but if a full-grown male leopard were to fight a full-grown female hyena, at the end of the day, I think I would side with the leopard. For this fight to occur, the leopard would probably start the fight with an ambush of sorts, right? Singing his teeth into her neck and stabbing her with her cl uh, claws and just holding her until she succumbs to blood loss or suff suffocation. Uh, however, if he misses the pounce or if she is able to slip out of his grasp, well, and is able to get at least a solid bite on the leopard anywhere, I think that would turn the tide in her favor. For sure. Not to mention her much better stamina. She's built to outlast almost anything, whether it's in a chase or in a fight. And with a similar sized animal, uh, yeah, I'd say the hyena would get the win on that. And if she gets, like I said, one, at least one solid bite in, <laughs> I think it'd be over for the leopard. Uh, because, because even if the leopard kept fighting, I do think it would just die because it'd be too much in pain. But even if it tried to run, the leopard will outdo it and be able to chase it down. However, uh, I believe if the leopard sticks the ambush like he knows how to, then yeah, I'm siding with him every, after a very long struggle. The hyena will not go down easy and the leopard will have to hold her there. Uh, for a long while, but I believe this would happen more times than not, and yeah, I'd say the leopard wins six out of ten times over a uh, hyena. The leopard wins. Like and subscribe if you did enjoy. Leave a comment of what you thought, and hit the notification bell to be notified of all my future videos and all the great stuff. I'll catch you guys in the next one, and I truly do appreciate it. Peace.